After chapter 825, our number break is upon us and it's going to be a long one. It's not always a bad thing, it just gives me more time to reflect on recent chapters and bring out some theories. This video, I found a link with Sanji's family and a fairy tale called Twelve Brothers. There are many versions of this story, but firstly, I'll be talking about the German version. Revelations start to support that the Vinsmoke might actually be a royal family. I mentioned in my previous video that Germa 6 are just another government body within the world government and one of the kings who will be attending might be Sanji's father, but we will talk about this later. To the 12 brothers story, it starts off about a king who wants to kill his 12 sons so that his 13th child would be a girl so she alone can inherit his kingdom. Queen tells this to their youngest son and that she will give warning with a flag. After 12 days of waiting in the forest, the son sees a red flag indicating that they shall be sentenced to death. Brothers swear bloody revenge on every girl and move to an enchanted cottage deep in the forest where they must feed on animals. 10 years later, after hearing of their existence, the sisters find them there where the queen hid them for caution. Together, the siblings live in harmony. But as the sister rips out 12 white lilies out of ignorance, her brothers turn to ravens and fly away. At the behest of an old woman, she decides not to speak and not to laugh for 7 years in order to save her brothers. Well, Sanji saving his sister would be different from the Sanji's mother theory and also why he is so protective of women. Key elements that I would like to take out from that story would be the 12 brothers part. Could Sanji have 12 brothers? Let's have a look to see is it possible and did he stay long enough with the Vinsmoke to witness all the 12 siblings and a potential sister? It was confirmed by me in the manga that Sanji is the third brother. That would mean 3 brothers are confirmed so far. We even saw in the marine comic strip that brothers 1 and 2 do exist. Sanji was 9 years old when he met Zef. If a sibling was born in every year of those 9 years, then that would be 12 siblings altogether. I do not think this is at all a coincidence. Now the story is about a king and those 12 brothers would be princes. I know I confirmed that Sanji is from a family of assassins and the manga then later confirmed. Do not rule out that the Vinsmokes are also one of the royal families. It has been foreshadowed back when Sanji called himself Mr. Prince. In the Davy back fights, Sanji wore that hat that looked like a crown. In Thriller Bark, when his zombie also wore a similar hat. The brand that he used to smoke was called King Ground. In chapter 825, Caesar complained he was getting the prince treatment. And if this makes sense to you, then it means that his father is also a king. Hope you're liking it so far guys, leave a like. One of the king who is attending the reverie has an appearance that we could speculate a lot on. The moustache that he has has that Vinsmoke curl that clearly be seen and since we saw one of Sanji's brothers, the curl must be genetic in every member of the family. Another thing is why would half his face be concealed if he was just a normal king attending? Another thing that got to me was that the king had a clock on his chin. I do not think that it means he's from the Clockworld Island or he represents Cogsworth from Beauty and the Beast but more of his powers itself. The clock on his chin can also represent the 12 brothers as well. Each digit represents a brother. Hope this has got you thinking right now. Back to the story. The 12 brothers swearing revenge on every girl and hating the sister must have affected the way Sanji see women. A hunting king finds the princess and marries her. His mother, however, slanders the girl, silence, and convinces the king to burn her. The rescued brothers save her from the flames and with the mother-in-law executed, all live happily together. A wedding is involved in the story, so it would be interesting if someone of the Vinsmoke would stop Sanji's wedding. His sister maybe? 
Another version of this fairy tale is a Norwegian fairy tale called the Twelve Ducks, which has a similar story to the Twelve Brothers, but the princes instead were given to a troll duck instead of just turning into ravens and hiding in the forest. While looking back at the One Piece SBS, I found something interesting in SBS Volume 20. A reader asked Oda, out of the five crew members, Luffy, Zoro, Usopp, Nami and Sanji, what animals do they represent? And Oda-san replies with, Luffy's a monkey, Zoro is a shark, Usopp is an armadillo, Nami is a cat, and Sanji is a duck. This is all quite a nice coincidence. Other variations of story include the six swans, the twelve wild ducks as I mentioned, Yudia and her seven brothers, the wild swans, the seven ravens, and the magic swan geese, so do check them out guys for more information. The reveal of Sanji's brother is quite interesting, and that's because he has a strong resemblance to Zoro. It makes you wonder if the arguments they have is because Zoro resembles Sanji's brother. That would indeed be funny. I looked at this picture again, you can't see much except this guy who seems to look like this person in the underground. But one thing in the story that caught my attention was explained that the 12 brothers would change into ravens when hiding in the forest. And when you think of raven, you think of another character. The number one in the revolutionary army seems to be using raven like powers. Is this all a coincidence? Is the number one commander of the revolutionary army a Vinsmoke or Sanji's brother? What do you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for watching.